Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to day four of Holiday Me. I think that's where we're at. First and foremost, I have to apologize if I seem a little off or low energy. I woke up ill today, which is so unfortunate, but the show must go on, so I am going to film this and then just chill for the rest of the day, but I needed to get this filmed. Luckily, it's nothing like awful. I just kind of feel like I need to lay down and my throat hurts. My nose isn't stuffy, but there's like snot in my throat. That's a cute way to start off this video, hey. But today's video, just like the title says, is my affordable and easy gift guide. Everything I'm mentioning is $50 and under. Not everything quite reaches $50. There's a lot of affordable gifts in this and it's just things I've been loving throughout the year. I feel like it's kind of a random array of things but when I look at all this stuff I get really excited and it's some of the things that I want to give as gifts. I also have arranged a couple like combo gifts if you want to do it that way. But yeah, I kind of have a lot to cover so we're gonna get started. I won't stay too long on any one thing because a lot of the stuff you guys have heard me talk about before and I just don't want this video to be 45 minutes long. So I have kind of three categories, beauty, lifestyle, and home. So let's just start with beauty, just cause why not? So I do always like to mention some nail polish cause I am the nail polish queen. Am I in focus? Also the queen of not being in focus. Sometimes it likes to focus on that fox behind me and I get real pissed. So if you are wanting to give the gift of nail polish, just maybe you're giving like a pamper night gift, which a lot of these things can be mixed and matched if you wanna do, you know, kind of like a pamper basket, just put a few things together. A lot of these are great stocking stuffers. So I wanted to include some of the more festive Hello Kitty nail polishes, which I have a video coming on the like a haul of the ones I picked up that'll be coming a little later in Holiday Me. But a little spoiler for you, I have OPI Glitter to My Heart. These are from the Hello Kitty collection, I did say that. So the packaging is super cute, so I think it's fun. I think it's extra special because it's a limited edition with the fun packaging. So if you have a nail polish lover in your life, especially me, like I have racks of nail polishes, I always love when the tops are a little bit different. But I also think that these would go for a wide range of ages because they're Hello Kitty. So kids, teens, adults, me, I love Hello Kitty as well. And and they're also just like really good, fun, festive nail polishes. So like I said, this one is called Glitter To My Heart. It's a really fun, just like silver glitter top coat. I actually have it on top of white right now and I love it. It's just like the perfect like little hint of festive fun. There is some white glitter in there as well. So it'd be pretty over like light blue or even dark blue. Probably the one I'm most excited about and I am saving this for my Christmas nails. This is OPI Dream and Glitter. I have been dying for a red glitter for a while. And this is a little bit more on the like maroon red side, but it's pretty like true blue red glitter. And I cannot wait to put it on top of red polish and have red glittery nails for Christmas. And not every polish in the Hello Pity Mm. And not every polish in the ho <laughs> and not every single polish in the Hello Kitty collection is glitter. So they do have some more just like dark cream colors that I love. So it would have something for everybody, but it's just worth looking into if you have a nail polish lover in your life because it's super cute. And of course, I always have some bath bomb slash lush faves. This one is on the cheaper side, but it's so cute and festive. And I believe it's just called the Rudolph bath bomb. It smells really, really good. It smells very lush, but uh, it's similar to Cinders, which is a bath bomb from back in the day that I miss a lot. But it smells really, really good and it's under $6. So it's, I feel like the perfect gift price point. Lush bath bombs are kind of, they are expensive for what they are. So I always like to give them as gifts because it's not necessarily something that people would buy for themselves, but would totally enjoy using if they're a bath person. I always like to choose one that's a little bit more inexpensive if you want to mix and match. But then I also, this is a new product this year and why I think it would be a great gift is because it's basically an all-in-one bath product. So basically you take off the top and you pour the contents that it's inside under the running faucet and it kind of acts like your bubble bar. And I actually bought two of these. I got, I think it's, it's called something about like don't let the bells end. I used that one the other night and I loved it. It was fabulous. It created so many bubbles, which I was kind of skeptic about because I didn't know, is that bubble bar? Is it bath bomb? What is it? But I think it's a mixture of bubble bar, bath bomb, and some like bath salts. And then you can use the rest of it as a bath bomb. The other one was very moisturizing. So I think there's bath oil in it as well. And it's just a really great like all-in-one bath product that I think would make a really, really nice gift. And speaking of Lush, I have a couple more Lush recommendations. I think both of these together would make an adorable gift. You could also gift them separately obviously. You guys know I love the Sleepy Lotion from Lush. It is like my all-time, one of my all-time favorite products. I rely on it on night at night to sleep and I just love it. So it comes in a bunch of different ways and they actually do have a sleepy like gift set 
from Lush, which I don't have to show you, but I can put a picture in and I will link it down below if you want more of like an already wrapped present. The Lush gift sets are incredible. I love to give them. I love to receive them. Bradley knows it's like one of my favorite gifts to get. But if you wanted to buy things separately, I think this would be a really fun combo gift. You get the Sleepy Body Lotion and then this is a Christmas exclusive. It's the Sleepy Dust. It's dusting powder. You can like dust it on your pillow. It smells like vanilla and lavender. It smells incredible. It puts me right to sleep and I just think it's a super fun gift. And then lastly from Lush, I kind of have, well one of them is from Lush. It's another combo gift, which again you can give separately or together. But I think this would be really fun together. So this is the Galaxy Lip Scrub. It's the new lip scrub from the Christmas collection, which I am obsessed with. I mentioned this in my November favorites, which I can link up in the corner, but it is just incredible. And the Lush Lip Scrub is my favorite like lip scrub. Oh, pulled down the shirt a little too much, revealing a little too much of the ladies. The Lush Lip Scrub is my absolute favorite lip scrub formula. They're very affordable, they last forever, and they just work really, really well. So I love these in general, but I love this scent. It's kind of like a blue raspberry scent, like a blue Jolly Rancher. Smells incredible, I literally can't get enough. So I think this would be a fun gift paired with my other favorite lip product this year is the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. I've raved about this in so many different videos and on my Instagram and just everywhere. It is one of my favorite products I've discovered this year. It is just an incredible sleeping mask. You put it all over your lips right before you go to bed and when you wake up, your lips are so moisturized and almost still have a little bit of the balm on them. So it is a pricier gift. This is like $20. This I think is around $8. So I think Anybody would love receiving that, especially in the winter with the dry lips. Just a couple more beauty ones. People do like to give the gift of eyeshadow palettes, and I thought a really nice, more affordable way to do that was the butter eyeshadow palettes. These were some of my favorite most used, if not my most used eyeshadows this year. I believe these came out more towards the spring. They have two different versions. I have both because I got one. I loved it so much that I got the other one. So, or maybe they sent these to me. I don't really remember. My favorite one is called Tropical Days and this is what it looks like. If you have more of like a, well no, they're both good for neutrals. I don't know, but the Tropical Days one is a little bit more my speed. Um, I love this blush color. I love this color. I love this like orange terracotta color. Has some purples in there, a fun blue and some fun sparkle shades as well. And then the other one is called Sultry Night. So it's a little bit more of like a glam smoky situation. It has a lot of like gold shimmers. This is what I'm wearing today. I have quite a few of the shades on, but the main lid shade is this top corner one right here. And I, you guys know I love the butter blush or the butter products from Physicians Formula. I just, I love all of them. I'm wearing all of, I'm wearing the blush, the highlight and eyeshadow today. I should have wore the bronzer as well, but um, I just, I love these and they're $20 and some of the best, if not the best drugstore eyeshadow I've ever tried. So I would highly recommend these. Would be a great stocking stuffer as well, or just a good gift on its own because it's still like a really great high functioning eyeshadow palette. And then lastly for beauty, I have fragrance, which, it's gonna come as no surprise, but I have two of the Ariana Grande fragrances to suggest. Now, the Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume has been my favorite perfume of the whole year. I got it last year for Christmas and I've gone through three bottles. So that I, and I've never run out of perfume. So that should speak for itself. It, I, I think that these are good because even if you don't like Ariana Grande, they're still very good scents that I think cover a lot of ranges, whether you're 20, 30, or 40. I feel like there's something for everyone and the packaging is super cute. So um, I don't know, even if you're not a huge Ariana Grande fan, I just think they're really great perfumes at very affordable prices. So these are both the $50 size. They come in $40, $50, and 60. The Thank You Next perfume is a bit more of a mature scent. So keep that in mind if you're shopping for somebody a little bit more mature, but I prefer the Ariana Grande Cloud. It is very light and like fluffy and clean but fruity. I just, it's, I love it so much. And so many of you guys have commented that you bought it on my recommendation and you're loving it as well. So that makes me so happy. Love it. I think it would make an amazing gift. So yeah. Okay guys, that is it for beauty. Let's move on to home products. So the first one is very affordable and very cool. This is the Candle Tin Trio from Trader Joe's. You could of course buy this for yourself like I did, but how great of a gift would this be? It's the perfect stocking size. You could just fill up the stocking or you can wrap it, comes easily in the box, but you get three different scents. It's cranberry, pine, fresh currant, and nutmeg. I've smelled all of them. They smell incredible. You guys hear me talk about these candles all the time. I really, really enjoy them. They are soy, so it's a little bit healthier for you. And these and the Mrs. Myers candles are my favorite bathroom candles. I just think they're the perfect size. I love the like silver tin they come in. I, I just love the Trader Joe's candles. So when I saw like a cute little gift set, I was like, that is amazing. I have to buy it. And I thought I would include it. So, and I've been to Trader Joe's a couple times since, and they've done a good job at keeping this in stock. So definitely 
check it out next time you're there if you want to pick one up. Next are these Rifle Paper Company and Anthropology glasses. I mentioned these in my holiday home haul. Somebody's beating the dumpster outside. But these are Nutcracker themed drinking glasses and they are so cute. I bought all four of them and if you wanna see more on that, I will link that home haul up in the corner. I won't stay on these too long, but they're $12 each and I think they would make an amazing hostess gift or maybe somebody, you know, just moved into a new apartment or a new house or maybe just somebody loves Christmas or the Nutcracker and it's a, just a really beautiful gift, I think. They're really nicely made and they have gold rims and I just think they're beautiful. So I thought I'd mention that. And I think I already said they're $12 a piece so you can do two together you could do only one you could do all four for still under fifty dollars they're beautiful and i tried to link them for you guys in my home haul they're not online so definitely check in store for these i'll try again of course so check down below but they're definitely worth going to the store to check them out one of my favorite products this year in discoveries is the essential oil roll-ons from young living you guys know that i am a young living bitch <laughs> if you will i love young living i have loved the addition of essential oils into my life and they've just changed my life in a really positive way and and I discovered the roll-ons this year and I am obsessed. So all of them except of course my favorite one is under $50. Peace and Calming I think it's a little over 50 which is annoying but it's worth it. It's just the best. But I just have a few to share. I have Thieves which is their immune blend. It's also the blend they use in their cleaning products. It smells like Christmas which is very appropriate. It smells really, really good. It took me a minute to get used to it, but now I love the way it smells. And I've been using this one a lot to roll on the bottoms of my feet because it's just great immune support. So there's lots of different ways you could use Thieves, but that's just kind of Young Living staple, so that would be a good gift. I have Tranquil, which is basically coconut and lavender. It is so loud outside right now. Can everybody relax? Oh, and it's raining, that's fun. So Tranquil is lavender and vanilla. I clearly need some right now with all these noises outside. It smells so freaking good. I like to rub this behind my ears and maybe a little bit under my nose right before I go to bed. It's a very like sleepy time blend. It's amazing, especially for if you have anybody that loves lavender, like there's no way they won't love this. And then one of my all time favorites is Stress Away. This is basically like lavender, lime, and vanilla. It smells like a vacation in a bottle. Wow. I don't leave the house without this thing. It saves my life every day. I just, I love it. It's one of my favorite oils. So this was the first like roll on I bought and I was like, oh, these are life changing. So I bought all of them. So yeah, there's more. There's one called Breathe On. There's one called Deep Relief, which is also one of my favorites. I don't leave the house without that because it helps with my jaw pain. And then I think there's a couple others that are over $50, which is insane, I know. But they would make a beautiful stocking stuffer when you order them. They come in this kind of like really beautiful paper round packaging. It's like cardboard, but it's really thick and it looks really nice. So it would be perfect stocking stuffer or you can like mix it with something else or on its own. It's a great gift. So I thought I would recommend those. A super random one, but one of my favorite gift ideas this year are air plants. I, I don't know if it's like my age or like the time we're in, but maybe once everybody turns like between 27 and 30, they get into house plants. Oh, excuse me, my taquitos are done. What was I saying? Oh, something about people my age, me turning this age as well, I'm really into plants now. I've always had an interest in like outside gardening, but it was in the last like two years that I've discovered an interest in indoor plants as well. And I think a lot of people are interested in it, but are afraid to try it. So I think that air plants are a really, really great introduction because they are very low maintenance. They don't even need soil to grow. They just need the air. And people water their air plants different ways. I put mine upside down in a bowl of water for about 30 minutes and then out to dry usually like once every three weeks. Um, these are two of my faves. I haven't had any luck finding them at like Lowe's or Home Depot, but my favorite place to find them is at Armstrong Nursery. I've also gotten some on Amazon. I can link some down below that I've ordered before, but I just think they're great. So you can give an air plant and then like a pot. This is literally a tiny ass little pot that I got at Michael's for 50 cents, but like how cute is that gift? But then also I wanted to mention this as a gift on its own, but this is called the female form vase. It's from Urban Outfitters. This is like one of the most things I was asked about this year every time it's shown in a video or in a photo so I definitely wanted to share. It was $16. It's huge. It's just basically a girl's butt and her vag. <laughs> and you can use this as a ton of different things. You could use a storage, a, a normal vase for flowers, but I use it as an air plant holder. Oh, piece of my hair. And I just have this up on the bathroom shelf and I love it. I think it is so cute. So something like that would be really, really fun. Another planter I recently picked up along the same vein is this boob planter from Urban Outfitters as well. It has hearts over the boobs, 3D boobs, and I think it's really, really cute. It's gonna look super cute with green coming out of it. I just got it so I don't have a plant for it yet, but I just love this and it was $12. So I wanted to mention that as well and I'll have it linked down below. But yeah, I just think a house plant would be a great 
gift idea. Some of the easier ones are snake plants, of course. You, like, you literally don't have to water those and they don't need any sunlight. They're amazing. Pothoses are great. So just, you know, any indoor plant that is really low maintenance, I think would be a really fun gift and a cute pot as well. And then we have lifestyle. So I mentioned this, I've mentioned this, I think, for the last two years, but I love the Sugarfina candy cubes. This is one right here. My personal favorite is the ice cream cones. They are so good. And they are kind of more of like a high-end candy, like a box is $7.50, so that's like a lot to buy for yourself for candy. But these make a perfect stocking stuffer. I gave them as gifts in like my bridal party gifts. I got like the champagne gummy bears because it was like a celebration, you know. I have to eat one right now. My personal favorites are the blue, obviously. I can't get to one right now, so I'll just have a pink. Oh my god, they're so good. I don't know why I'm trying to eat and film. But they have a bunch of different candy options. These just happen to be my favorite. And now you can get these in the checkout line at Nordstrom Rack. That's where I found these. And I was like, oh, now I don't have to go. The Sugarfina stores can be random. You can also order them online. So I'll have these linked down below. But they're so good. I realize that I'm super late to this party, but I love my Instax camera. My sister got me this for the year of the wedding. Just because, like, it was fun to have Polaroids from, like, my bachelorette my bridal shower, the actual day of the wedding we have some Polaroids so it's just fun and I brought it to my birthday party and I have a lot of cute little photos from that and I just think it's so cute and I've always loved Polaroid cameras. I have a couple vintage Polaroid cameras. They make it hard to find normal Polaroid film anymore so I don't use them as much but this one I think is so fun and I did find this camera for like pretty much exactly $50 on Amazon so I'll link it down below which I don't think that comes with freaking film so I guess that would be putting it over but maybe you can get it at Michael's. They also have a lot of great coupons at Michael's and they sell these. I also just ordered myself some more film. Um, I got some like really cute confetti film. It just came today from Amazon. I'm really excited. Um, but I just think this would be an amazing gift for just pretty much a girl of any age. And they're super cute, like on a shelf, and they come in all different colors. I think I have like the ice blue or something like that. I just think this is a great gift idea, and I'm loving mine. And last but not least, I feel like I always mention this, but it is a great gift idea. It is the Erin Condren Life Planner. I get a lot of questions about where my planning videos went. I have stopped paper planning. Um, I did, however, order the new planner, the monthly planner though, not the weekly. Um, I do still use paper to map out my videos and just kind of work-related stuff. So I thought it would be nice to have in a book instead of me just printing out printable calendars. <laughs> so I did order that, but it hasn't arrived yet. But it's just basically a weekly calendar that you have all these boxes that you can fill into your desire. It has a lot of space. It's very customizable and you can kind of organize it however you want. Um, they kind of have thought of everything. You can get removable covers and change out the color seasonally if you want. Um, and it's just a great gift for the organized person in your life. And I think it is about $50, but if you use my code, it will get you $10 off. So I'll have the link down below. Just give me a little bit of a kickback just so you know, but it also does save you $10. And I just, I love this. I, I've given these as gifts for years because the women in my life love them and yeah so they're super fun and customizable and great but okay guys that is it for my gift guide I hope you found this helpful again I will have everything linked down below so it's easy you can order it right now if you want and get it a time for Christmas I'm also going to be doing a what I want for Christmas like a Christmas wish list video so that should be up soon so subscribe right here if you haven't already and I'll have some videos down here you can click and watch and as well as if you've missed the holiday me videos so far I am uploading every other day until Christmas so I'll have the playlist linked up there as well and yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this and i hope it gave you some inspiration and some help and some yeah i hope you guys have a great day i will talk to you very soon and i'll see you in the next one bye